Well, we have something here, um, which I, one, one of my producers gave me before you came out here, which is one of my favorite things I've ever read, written by a child. You know what I have here? Uh, yes, it's a will I wrote. Um. <laughs> when you were how old? I'd say eight, based on the handwriting. Okay. And uh, would you mind reading? To, let me just show you a yeah. picture. This is the will. Written on okay. a funeral home paper. <laughs> Why did you have funeral home? Was your family in the biz? No, I think my great aunt had just died, sadly, and maybe that inspired me to start thinking about the future. Maybe, I don't, maybe. Yeah. Would you mind reading to the, the good people yes. some of the things that you were thinking about when you were eight years old? And again, this is a, a child terrified of uh, life. Everything, okay. yeah. Okay, uh, Gillian Jacobs as well. One, everything I own, no one will get. Oh, it's understandable. Mm -hmm. Okay. Number two, my home or current residence shall always stay mine. Mm -hmm. Three, everything shall be left as I had it. Four, my car shall stay in the garage. Number five, this is where it gets good. Yes. I shall be cremated by monks in France. So did you know what cremated meant when you were eight years old? I must have, but I don't think I quite understood the Catholic Church because I don't think monks often perform cremations. Yeah, yeah. Um, You're special. Yeah. You're special, they do, all right? Okay, six. No one but the monks shall see me cremated. You better not look at my ass. No, it's a treat. It's yes. a treat. Mm. Okay, seven. No one shall mourn me. Number eight. My family is to blame for my death. Uh, number nine. They joked one too many times. Mm hmm. Number ten. Their souls shall not be at rest until I forgive them. And number eleven. That shall be never. I, I love eight-year-old you.